welcome to the Spring 2021 Virtual Commencement Ceremony. Please join us in the singing of our national anthem. Now presenting Dean Cami Abernathy. Good afternoon. I am Cami Abernathy, Dean of the Herbert Wertheim College of Engineering. It gives me great pleasure to welcome members of our UF community, friends, family members, and most of all, graduating students of the University of Florida class of 2021. We are excited to celebrate with you during this virtual commencement ceremony. It is my pleasure to introduce our commencement speaker today, Dr. Gary Miller. Gary Miller is co-founder and executive vice president for research and development of Exact Tech Inc., Gainesville, Florida. Exact Tech was incorporated in 1985 and develops, manufactures, and distributes orthopedic implants and biologic materials for orthopedic applications throughout the world. A native Floridian from Jacksonville, Gary has been married to Susie Liss Miller, also a Gator grad, for 51 years. They have three children and six grandchildren. Dr. Miller received his Bachelor of Science degree in Mechanical Engineering in 1970 from the University of Florida, a Master's in Mechanical Engineering from MIT in 1972, and a PhD in Mechanical Engineering, Biomechanics and Biomaterials Emphasis in 1977 from the University of Florida, proudly a double gator. Post-graduation, he joined the faculty of the UF Department of Orthopedics in 1977, serving as a postdoctoral fellow, assistant and associate professor, and then as Director of Orthopedic Research and Biomechanics, until leaving UF in 1997 to concentrate fully on his duties at Exact Tech. Over the years, he has served as an Adjunct Associate Professor in various departments of the, of the University of Florida Wertheim College of Engineering and the College of Vet Medicine Orthopedics, and now holds a Courtesy Professorship in the Department of Mechanical and Aerospace Engineering. He is the past Chairman of the Herbert Wertheim College of Engineering Dean's Advisory Board and remains active on the board. Gary also enjoys providing guest lectures, mentoring, and participating on the industrial advisory boards of the mechanical and aerospace engineering and biomedical engineering departments. He is a member of many professional organizations, including being a founding member of the Society for Biomaterials, membership in the Orthopedic Research Society, the American Society for Testing and Materials, and the American Society for Mechanical Engineers. He has served as a consultant to various orthopedic companies and the U.S. Food and Drug Administration. He holds more than 20 patents in the U.S. and abroad. Publications include book chapters and more than 65 articles and 100 abstracts in the areas of biomechanics and biomaterials. He has presented this work and lectured on orthopedic biomechanics, implant and instrument design, and biomaterials throughout the world. Gary is also one of our most recent recipients of the University of Florida's Distinguished Alumnus Award. With both his storied career and his work as a volunteer for the college, he fully embodies what it means to be a distinguished alumnus of the university. And we are incredibly proud to call him a Gator engineer. With that, I will hand it over to Dr. Miller. Thank you, President Fox and Dean Abernathy for this honor and the privilege of addressing this amazing group of Gator engineers. The class of 2021, you're graduating in person, on campus in the Exact Tech Arena. 
This class's perseverance is off the charts. I've had two really memorable graduations from this university. My bachelor's in 70 and doctorate in 77. And now, 44 years later, receiving this award with the opportunity to address your graduating class? It's truly fantastic. Reflecting on almost six decades since arriving in Gainesville in 65 and how my career has evolved makes me smile. I showed up wanting to learn about machines, and mechanical engineering was the right course. Machine design was my real calling. That was the last thing that seemed scripted on the sometimes meandering and serendipitous path that brings me here today. I'm sure that some of you may have a tinge of uncertainty about what you'll pursue with your degree, and if you're ready to pursue your career, but that's okay. In all aspects of our lives these days, personal, social, business, and beyond, we're now referring to a new normal. Sometimes I, it seems as if we all think these changes will happen to us. I'd like for you to think of it differently, that you will help create that new normal. After all, you're engineers, and that's what engineers do. These last 44 years as a biomedical engineer allowed me to have a small part creating a new normal for people needing orthopedic implants. It's important, though, to remember to stay in the present. Even though 2020 and these months that follow may be difficult, please realize that it's not only about inventing new things, but let's face it, reinventing yourselves to meet new challenges and create that wonderful new normal you want to live in. I'm confident that this class has the foundation and will continue to acquire the knowledge, experience, and wisdom to bring about positive changes in our world. It's a heavy lift, but there's no doubt that you're up to the task. It's worth saying again. When engineers face changes or have questions, they see opportunities and find solutions. The teamwork you've learned to solve real life problems will be in your knowledge toolbox forever, making you all the more valuable to employers and academic institutions around the globe. I've been asked from time to time by students, what did you study? What courses? How'd you become an entrepreneur? Because I want to do that. My replies have varied, but there are important nuggets that helped me immensely on my personal journey, which I hope resonate with you. They fall into a few, often inseparable, groups. Innovation, collaboration, communication, leadership, and a continuous pursuit of learning new things. I was drawn to mechanical engineering by a lifelong curiosity of learning how things work. It was a natural thing for me, so the thought of actually studying to be creative or innovative seemed a bit strange. But I quickly saw that to really understand and solve problems, you needed math and physics, the sciences and the humanities. Let's call them foundational tools in your toolbox. And importantly, you need an environment with the people and the time and the resources to nourish your creativity and your inventor spirit. I've also never been able to wake up and say, I'm going to invent something today. Not sure that Ada Lovelace, Edison, Granville Woods, Steve Jobs, Bill Gates, any of them did either. You may not recognize all the names, but they were brilliant at seeing the world's unmet needs. Engineers are presented with and observe situations that need good solutions. Solutions that are sometimes innovative and may be truly inventive. Often it's just serendipity. Trust that your education has given you what it takes to meet the engineering challenges and needs of humankind. To do this, you must communicate effectively. Experience taught me the incredible value of communication. That effective communication is two-way, talking and listening. It's about sharing. Having to explain your work often makes both listener and presenter understand things better. Have you ever noticed that when you don't have a common language or a knowledge base, the conversation slows? 
thoughts are distilled, and finding other ways to share information leads to a richer understanding. Writing is also key. Writing clearly, and even sometimes even drawing on the back of a napkin or on the tablecloth, has led me down the path of discovery many times when I couldn't speak the other person's language. It's times like this that a picture is indeed worth a thousand words. So be open and honest and build the trust that is key to effective communication and enhances collaboration. Stop and think how many ingenious people were part of a team. Einstein wasn't great at math and collaborated with Marcel Grossman and Michelle Besso, Burstein and Frankel in biomechanics, Jobs and Wozniak, Gates and Allen, Ben Cohn and Jerry Greenfield, great ice cream. Cross-functional collaboration has been key for me and really changed my perspective early on. I've continuously benefited from working with an amazingly diverse group of people, not just in mechanical engineering, but material science, human and vet medicine, dentistry, computer science, anthropology, so many more. And working as a research fellow with the medical school faculty in orthopedics, continuing as a research faculty member there for 18 years. When I began this journey of collaboration, I never imagined it would eventually lead to the co-founding of Exact Tech 36 years ago, and it continues to this day. For me, the collaborative sum has surely always been greater than the parts. Steve Jobs famously said it so well. Great things are never done by one person, but by a team of people. It's also important to keep learning. Let's be candid. There's too much to know, too many unknowns to ever have your toolbox full. Technology's moving too fast. It's been said one thing we know for sure is that change is certain. And remember, progress isn't certain. Progress depends on the choices we make today for tomorrow and on whether we meet our challenges and protect our values. Don't be surprised if solutions take you beyond the traditional roles of engineering. You may find yourself as a technology officer or CEO, having a global presence for your work, drawing on varied ideas while creating solutions that benefit people everywhere. In entering business, it became clear that success requires other skills too, beyond the passion for the solution itself. Business skills, regulatory or legal skills, other skills not in your toolbox yet, but to be sure you don't necessarily need to know everything yourself. It ties back to learning to assemble a team, collaborate and communicate. Your class is leaving here with a solid education to jumpstart the realization of your dreams. Feel good that your diversity will serve to move the world forward in a positive way with your unique talents, your goals and dreams. Let me close on a different note. The positive feelings you get giving back to those people and institutions that have helped you along your path to success lasts a lifetime. Personally, giving back to our university by teaching, mentoring, board participation, endowing a lab to provide opportunities that nurture education and cutting edge research and development, all continue to bring me great satisfaction. I urge you to stay in touch with the College of Engineering, UF, your classmates, and the Gator Nation. Do good for humankind. There are some daunting tasks ahead, be they in healthcare or the environment, you name it. Rest assured that by seeking to do good, by improving people's lives in whatever discipline you choose, the world will be better. Get out there and mix it up with confidence and commitment Collaborate, communicate, innovate, learn and lead, and stay humble. That's what graduating Gator engineers are primed to do. Thanks so very, very much, and go Gators. It is our strong belief that this ceremony belongs to our students. In recognition of this belief, we invited two representatives of our graduating class to provide a brief perspective of their college experience. I'm glad to introduce Kathleen Plinsky, followed by Blake Studer. Hi, 
Hi, I'm Kathleen Plinsky. And to my fellow graduates, please allow me to be among the first to congratulate you on this important step in our journeys. We made it. I am what you would call a non-traditional student. This is my third master's degree, and in many ways, it's the most meaningful. Way back in 1997, when some of my fellow graduates may not have even been born yet, I was a bright-eyed freshman at Indiana University, excited to major in physics. I didn't enter college with a lack of confidence in my academic abilities, but the absence of women in physics led me to doubt myself. You see, there weren't any female physics professors and there were usually only one or two other females in my physics classes. After a while, I began to wonder if there was a good reason that I didn't see any other women in physics. In fact, I remember questioning if there was something biologically different about my brain that made it harder for me to do vector calculus and learn the tenets of electricity and magnetism than it was for my male peers. By the time I concluded my sophomore year, these doubts had begun to extinguish my passion for physics. Nevertheless, I participated in a particle physics internship where we were looking for experimental evidence that a particle consisting of three gluons that theoretical physicists had conceived of and lovingly called a glue ball would be created from high energy collisions of protons. My internship consisted of plotting data collected by a detector. And if there was a spike in the graph at just the right spot, it would suggest that a glue ball was created and ultimately decayed into light. I am so thankful for this internship because it helped me realize that physics was not what I wanted to do for the rest of my life. If I had known what engineering was before going to college, I think I would have likely chosen engineering as a major. I wanted to make a difference with what I was learning. I wanted to apply what I was learning to help others. And I didn't personally find that fulfillment in looking for glue balls. But by the time that I learned that engineering was more closely aligned to the work that called me, I was already into my junior year at a university that didn't have an engineering school. So I did the next best thing. I added Spanish as a major. In 2001, I graduated with a bachelor's degree in physics and Spanish. In 2001, I also wondered, what in the world do you do with a bachelor's degree in physics and Spanish? Over the next 20 years, I discovered the answer to that question. I started a career working at community colleges, having recently been selected to serve as the president of Valencia College in Orlando. And I earned a master's in Spanish, a doctorate in education, and an MBA from the University of Florida. Fast forward to the summer of 2019. I noticed an ad on Facebook that said, do you have a bachelor's degree in a technical field and an MBA from UF? I thought to myself, that's me. Who else could it be? It was total clickbait, right? I learned of this opportunity to earn a master's in industrial and systems engineering and felt somehow that things were coming full circle. Here was the chance that I honestly never thought I would have to study engineering. I submitted the application for admissions and believe it or not, all of the old self-doubt came back. Even after having earned two other master's degrees and a doctorate, I wondered if I had the brain power to earn a master's degree in engineering. When it came time for the admissions interview, the chair of the program was scheduled to call. I am embarrassed to admit that I was surprised to hear a woman's voice when I answered the phone. However, imagine my delight to discover that the program chair was a female professor. I felt comfortable expressing my self-doubt to her. When she asked me if I had any questions, 
I asked her if she thought that I could be successful in the program. I confess that, for example, I did not remember how to do integration by parts since I had last taken calculus in 1999. And she replied, that's okay. I don't remember how to do integration by parts, but if I needed to, I could look it up and reteach myself and so could you. Her honesty and vulnerability in her reply were refreshing and her confidence in my abilities was just what I needed to believe in myself. I decided to begin the journey. And what a journey it has been from creating mathematical models to solve optimization problems, to minimizing costs of a supply chain, to learning about stochastic methods and complex statistical analyses. I felt welcomed and supported in a community of learners, which by the way, includes many women colleagues. And while I am thankful to have learned some of the tools and vocabulary of industrial and systems engineering, I'm even more thankful to have learned thanks to this amazing community of peers and incredibly supportive faculty and staff that I do indeed have the brain power to engage in really complex mathematical modeling, formulation, and problem solving. And that is knowledge that will never go out of date. Today's ceremony is called commencement as it marks the start of something new rather than simply the end of a journey. As you embark on what comes next, I implore you to pursue your passion, follow your heart, and don't doubt yourself or your abilities, and never ever give up on your dreams, even if they are deferred by a decade or two, and never stop learning. So I'm guessing this wasn't exactly the senior year that we all had in mind. As I'm sure that you've all noticed, our world has experienced some radical changes over the past 14 months and left behind a landscape that not many of us can recognize. As the world adapts to these changes, we're going to encounter a multitude of problems that need solving. Thankfully, who better to solve these problems than the problem solvers themselves? The engineers. In fact, the world is fortunate to have the UF engineering class of 2021 graduate when we are because we are just the people to rebuild the world. Not back into what it was before the pandemic, but into something better, faster, more efficient. But how do we do that? How do we accomplish this gargantuan task? Well, one of the men I admire most taught me everything I know about completing difficult tasks. And I would like to share his wisdom with you today. The man's name is Gene the Machine Hendon, and he got his nickname from seemingly being able to handle problem after problem after problem without end during his time in the Air Force. However, as my grandfather, I never knew him by Gene the Machine, but rather simply as Poppy. Now, Poppy was the master of getting things done, and he helped forge my knowledge in the toils of his chosen battleground, yard work. The yard is where I would gain my stripes, and it seemed like no matter how little time had passed, it always had something that needed fixing. The leaves kept falling, or the grass kept growing, or the mulch kept disappearing, anything and everything. Honestly, it's, it's wild to think that I have been involved in some of the production of the most advanced aircraft in the world, and yet whenever I think of the words difficult task, the images that come into my head are raking, mulching, mowing, edging, pulling up weeds, etc. I mean, it just sounds like nonsense. Yet Poppy managed to create this weekly task into the lesson of a lifetime. So much so that I've been able to apply it anywhere and everywhere I go. Well, Poppy's first lesson was a rather simple one, but I'd say that it's universally applicable. Back when I used to rake the leaves in the backyard, I would tie up the finished trash bag full of leaves, run it back over to the garage, and get a new bag. Now, Poppy would always bring out a chair and watch me while I worked, mentally taking notes on everything I was doing to complete my assigned task. And after watching me run back and forth between the backyard and the garage multiple times, he finally just ended up yelling, why don't you just take the damn roll of trash bags with you? It's simple ergonomics. Now, I had no idea what ergonomics meant since I was 10, and not an industrial engineer. 
odd foreshadowing for the future. But the other thing he said was absolutely right. I've been wasting a bunch of time running back and forth for no reason. From that point on, whenever watching my work, he would give me tips for ways I could be faster, more effective, while still completing the same amount of work. Mow the yards in patterns rather than just randomly. When you have to go to the front, bring the trash with you, since it has to be at the end of the street anyway. The lesson was indeed simple. Everything can be done better. Even if you think that something is being done in the absolute best way possible, you can still find a way to make it better. When we start rebuilding some of the old systems in the world, we need to focus on this lesson, even if we cannot initially see it. Poppy's second lesson came about because of some dishonesty on my part. Obviously, a young kid, tween, teen, is not going to enjoy spending his Saturday afternoon working in the yard. I would much rather be doing just about anything, honestly. As such, I used to find little ways to cut corners, like only mowing the parts of the yard that were easy to see on first glance, only spraying half the weeds, little things like that. Now, when Poppy eventually figured out I was doing this, he was very, very disappointed in me. He said, if you take on a job, you do it to the absolute best of your ability and nothing less. We're about to encounter many challenges so unique that if we take any kind of shortcuts, it could end in tragedy. We need to have the integrity to give the best of our ability because people are depending on us. We can't let them down. We gotta do it right. Now, the final lesson, as we wind, wind things down to a conclusion, every time I completed my task for Poppy, he took me to get a treat of my choice, to celebrate my conquest over the monumental task that is taking care of a yard. He said that when you do good work, you deserve to celebrate. And those are some of my favorite memories. We aren't machines. As we take step after step to rebuild this world, don't forget to celebrate your victories with the people you love, because those will be the moments you never forget. Everything can be made better. If you do something, do it right. Celebrate each and every victory. With these in mind, nothing can stop us. Now let's go celebrate. Thank you to all of our speakers. For those being commissioned, as well as our graduates who are veterans of the armed forces, we extend our congratulations and express our sincere appreciation for your willingness to serve in defense of our country and in the cause of peace. It is now time to recognize all of our graduates. I offer to each of you my heartiest congratulations and commend you to the Fellowship of Educated Women and Men. Ladies and gentlemen, I now present to you the class of 2021. Congratulations and go Gators. Please join us in the recognition of graduates. Oscar LaFontaine. Shirati Sai Prasad. thank my mom and dad uh, for their constant support. This one is for you. Happy birthday, mom. Anurag LNU. Christopher Adcock. Syed Afif. Radhika Agrawal. Subham Agrawal Samir Ahair Rachna Ahirvar Arizona Ahmad Venkata Anisha Kella 
Solomon Sagar Albert Jayaraj. Eamon Al Gandhi. Syed Muhammad Ali. Madhuri Latayalam. Carson Allen. My the Elm Hiring. Ibrahim Al Mutab. Ibrahim Al Zarani. Sarah Amir. Sai Pranesh Amrasetti. Basil Anabtawi. Saurabh Anand. Yamuna Anupali. Nicholas Arakabala. Naman Aurora. Harshasvath. Sri Grishma Abadhutha. Bamsidhar Bada. Raghu Vamsi Badramahanthi. Lee Chin Bai. I really have a good time in you at. Thank you, everyone. You ball by. Suyash Bakli Wall. Hey, UF is a great school and I enjoyed my time here. It is an honor to have graduated from UF and recognized as an alumnus thanks to my parents and friends. Thank you. Kapish Yadav Banda. Drona Banerjee. Shashank Banticle. Win Shuan Bao Eshwarya Arborai Randall Barfield Sarah Barron Madura Basvarju Riley Bassett Arunabo Basu Luke Bauer Abine Reddy Robert Bazan Yaz Wonk Bellum Kush Bakta Hey, I just want to say thank you to my friends and my family. You guys have been awesome. And go Gators! Sahil Bala Vipra Band Aditya Bharat Watch Aditya Bhattacharya
Indira Bumareddy Ramaya. Sri Rishikesh Varma Bhupatiraju. Muhammad bin Shehan. Sean Burkholz. Christopher Blaylock. Himavanth Badu. Deep Badra. Christopher Brandt. Christian Bro. Michael Brill. Aaron Brzezinski. Kristen Buchenhorst. Mariana. Blake Burchett. Deep the Bainiti. Seamus Burns. Fang Yuen Kai. Merit John Aton. Başta ailem olmak üzere beni bu mutlu günde yalnız bırakmayan herkese teşekkür ederim. İyi ki varsınız. Go Gators. Shua Shuan Chao. Wei Heng Chao. Arpita Chakruverti. Piyush Camria. Pankaj Chand. Shashank Chandrasekhar Miragapa. Kai Chi Chong. Vicious Chaturvedi. Vikas Chaba. Sai Pradyumna Reddy Chedjardi. Inong Chen. HSIN Ling Chen. Yu Chen. Yuni Chen. Yu Fan Chen. Xiao Xiu Chen. Yu Fei Chen. Hari Hara Venathi Aichipuri. Choluan Chang. Tung Lin Chang. Puneet Kumar Chilakala. Arjun Chinamgari. Sai Shan Mokchinamili. Parth Paresh Chitroda. Joseph Nguk Choi. Thank you, God. Thank you, many educators, colleagues, and students. Thank you, friends, never sparing any encouragement for me. Harmony of Germany, Kamsamnida. Gracias a todos. Y let's get 
Rohit Prashant Chaudhari. Tilak Chaudhanahali Nagaraju. Niraj Dilip Chaudhari. Ritesh Chaudhari. Carl Christensen. Coralise Cologne Morales. Manuel Cortez Irizarry. Manuel Crespo Pena. Shane Cullen. Samantha Jo Cunningham. Hi, my name is Samantha Jo Cunningham, and I'm graduating with my master's in electrical and computer engineering. I just want to thank my friends and family for all their support. Go Gators! Diego Cusco Velasco. Helena Desne. Naeem Dagmesh Tian Fong Dai Bo Dai Sanjana Das Shreya Dasgupta Aniket Dash Anton Davis Luis de la Cruz Jessica Deming Hao Yin Deng Sujit Desai Kirti Desai Kandar Pranav Desai Darya Deshpande Keshvan Desi Khan Ananda Basita Desaraju Prazen Suresh Dershwar Parker Dai Funtaram Laura Dinwiddie Reiner Dizon Michael Dobbs Carmen Dominguez Prajwal Dondaganahali Prakash Naga Siddhartha Dona Puti Wan Yu Dong Happy graduation and go Gears Tirtha Doshi Marco Downing Which and do Alejandra Duarte, Jake Dudas,
Divyatha Sathishan Edichana. Spandana Idupiganti. Farid El Haddad. Patrick Everett. Jia Fong. Yi Fong. Rida Fatima. Noah Furson. Ashlyn Figura. Jared Flowers. Oren Ford. Clay French. For a Matul Gala. Rohan Nitin Gandhi. Tharshith Gandhi. It gives me immense pleasure to see myself as a CS grad from UF. Go Gators. Rajuth Ganesh. I'd like to thank my Appa, Amma, Akka, my friends, my family. Congratulations, everybody. Go Gators. Peace and love, Kapnande. Abhiram Reddy Gangasani. Yui Ching Gao. Jia Gao. Fan Gao. Sahil Guard. Alexander Garlaski. Subham Gorov. Juhi Gelda. Kaoming Gang Shantanu Ghosh Sagnik Ghosh I'd like to thank my parents and my family for motivating me to pursue graduate study and I would like to thank my friends, professors and the Holy Wef who made these two years everything that they were aware. Nayani Ka Ghosh Cody Gibson Jean Bogong Ran Kong Gong Prajwal Gaudru Shant Hamrathi Wins Goyle Rachel Grossman Gavin Grubbs Ankit Santosh Ujar Ichian Bua Greg Wall Ichun Gua Mayank Gupta Deekshant Gupta
Tejas Gurav. Jeevan Girihala. Rujuta Ashish Hajarnis. Nicholas Halverson. Bean Ruhan. Travis Hansen. Kelvin Hansen. Syed Hashmi. Calvin Hawkins. Arpita Nagaraj Hegde. Thank you so much, Appa, Amma, and Anna, for your unwavering belief and faith in me. Ashwani Hegde. Aditya Hegde. Arush Hegde. Ryan Henry. Camille Hernandez. Shannon Hickey. Chung Han Ho. Morgan Hodges. Aram Hong. Daniel Hoover. Xiaofei Ho. Kaifar and Xiong. Ting Wei Hu. Jiang Yu Hu. Nian Wen Hu. Xiao Hu. Ming Hui Huang. Lingyi Huang. Veronica Hubbard. Taylor Honeycutt. Ishion Hua. Jacob Hurst. Abigail Hyde. Hari Krishna Jagadish Kaladi. Deepen Jane. Saurabh Jane. Siddharth Jain Anishri Jain Udid Jaitley Akash Jaju Guru Prasad Jayachandran Milan Jayan Sagar Jayan Shetty Arian Jabelli Abhishek Ja Haran Jia
Jing Han Jia. Yu Jia. Tian Yu Jia. Xiao Xi Wen Jian. Zi Cheng Jian. Jing Yuan Jian. Kai Jian. Jing Jian. Nan Jian. Yu Chi Jin. Kevin John Matthew Matthew Johnson Henry Johnson McCartney Johnson Sri Conchuluro Carter Young Ankita Kadam Abdul Bayes Cadley Alex Khan Saurabh Gajanan Kakade Srinad Kakara Darshan Dilip Kakwani Sanyamal Calibra Parambil Joseph Muhammad Haroon Rashid Kalilar Rahman Mohit Kora Suhas Kamath M.M. Gita Kamath Coach War. Alexander Kamenz. Venkata Sindha Kandula. Suntosh Kanan. Aditya Karlakar Rohit Karamuri Thank you Mama Baba for your large support and thank you India for this great opportunity Go get us! Woo! We wake Lala Saheb Kashid Arthi Kashikar Dries Kasabi Kostub Kotkar Kayasuk Kato Akash Katragata Natalia Katura Sushane Call Mega Saikavakandala Chandani Kayla Jaron Kelleher Vibha Kere Mane Bussin
Alexis Kerr. Avik Kamaru. Rishabh Khanna. Muhammad Karami. Abdur Rahman Kiladar. Day Kim. Derek Klein. Anaga Kolari. Aditya Sai Prabarshi Kolari. Gopichand Komaneni. Jusin Kong. Cody Kapowski. Nikhil Koshin. Sambana Krishnan. Lydia Kubler. Harish Kugar Srikanta Babu. Hello, Appa, Amma, Chelli, friends and all Matas. Thank you so much. I'm happy to call myself a proud leader. Jai Karnatka, Jai RCB. Ardi Kulkarni. Abhishek Kulkarni. Sindhver Kumar. Akshay Kumar. Venkata Vikramaditya Varma Kunaparaja. Wan Chinkwa. Naga Ganesh Singh Kurchedi. Bharath Kazuma. Brian Lages. Pratik Lahoti. Mandar Lakhot. Sitanchu Sukmander Lamba. Siheo Lan. Troy Lapensi. Yogesh Laxman. Ariane Lazaro. Charles Lazimi. Min Chao Lu. In J. E. Lee. Wuso Lee. Joshua Levi. Jing Yu Lee. Zoming Lee. Runs Lee. Xu Wen Yu Lee. Xi Nyu Wen Lee. Yu Li Song Yang Li Jonan Li
Chin Li. Yu Long Li. Xiang Rui Li. Bin Li. Henny and Lee. Xin Jin Liao. Zihan Liao. Jia Jing Liao. Xiang Yuan Liao. Yung Hoon Lim Gao Ming Lin Xu Yang Lin Ziruan Lin Jun Yu Lin Chong Ting Lin Ji Yun Ling Thank you University of Florida Happy graduation Go Gators Anushka Linge Gabriella Lira Zishi Leo Hanwen Leo Kirsten Leo Guan Fu Leo Hanwen Leo Yilin Leo Song Young Leo Jia Ching Leo Inan Leo Anna Logan Yogesh Baran Logeshanmagam Risha Blockray Do the twenty nineteen me don't quit. Just don't quit. Prafik Luya. Young Jun Lu Yu Lu Ka Yuan Lu Tia Lovers Chin Luo Siheo Liu Zhao Hua Liu Twenty Twenty One Go Gators, let's go. Shingama Zihan Ma. Stephanie McKenzie Shinya Mai Hara Uha Maguluro Shibani Mahapatra 
Nihal Maipadi Shri Hari. Nikhil Molati. Vishnu Rao Malampudi. Lyle Maloney. Pavan Kumar Manjaputi. Muthu Kumar and Manoran. Emily Mansell. Eric Marks. Chirag Moreau. Jesse Martinez. Michael Moss. Andrew Matson. Rahul Moria. Prashant Rajesh Medani. Lavish Mehta. Alvaro Mendoza Grizels. Paula Mendoza Perilla. Shruti Menon. Barbara Morandino. Joke Bead Mesador Boyd. Jiming Me. Ruin You Meow. Tiffany Miller. Nihal Mishra. Raghul Viknish Mohan Kumar. James Moody. Wesley Moore. Yasni Ari Morales. Mara Mukhtar. Asish Mulapudi Elizabeth Munyan Avinash Muragesan Hayman Kumar Muragesh Prajvala Nagaraj Papa, Amma and Vishu, thanks a lot to my extended family and friends. It's been a wonderful journey. Go Gators! Mega Nagar Munoli. Gurpreet Singh Nadpal. Christopher Najum. Susai Nalawala. Sai Somia Nirala Deep T Narkuti Anita Narnavaram Sunket Naya Disha Nair Sashe Nair
Vasu Negi. Vira Venkata Shiva Teja Nemala. Hopton Nembari. Teresa Ng. Xu Chen Li. John Ping Nia. Shailini Nigam. Venkata Nimaga. Phoebe Nimix. Forum by Pinchandra Nirmal. Shrikar Siddharth Nidala. Anthony Noto. Krishna Teja Nithalapati. Chomo Hal. Kartik Vasudevoka. Ashuriam Olarai. Michael Olvera. Coriato. Sai Oyang. Kenneth Oyabo. Aditi Page. Nicholas Pius. Abhishek Paliwal. Mudit Paliwal. Bhavana Sri Palampati. Ritvik Palvankar. Lean Pan. Smrati Pandey. Urvi Parab. Meet Parik. Jayadik Parikshia. Reagan Parker. The Raj Mahesh Parayani. Vishwa Patel. Unmil Patel. Parth Patel. Yash Patel. Krutan Takpadil. Mohit Padil. Yash Paterkeen. Southrick Paul. Matthew Pegram. Travis Pemberton. Shue Young Pung. Wesley Piard. Frank Pistella. Sean Petoniak.
Kathleen Plinsky. Mustafa Punawala. Tanme Porwal. Richard Power. Priya Ramchandra Prabhu. Saurabh Kumar Prasad. Pranav Puranik. Chua Biao Chiao. Chang Xin Si Yu Chin Ming Xin Chu Tanvi Reddy Rakamalam Rahul Radhakrishnan Anirudh Mukundan Raghavan Arjun Tekat Raghavendra Nafiza Rahman Achyuth Rajendran Mirav by Pin by Rakaliya Anurag Relabandi Gautham Ramesh Rohan Rao Shweta Rathor Maharshi Ravo Canva Ravo Christopher Arie Celeste Renoig Jessica Rice Michael Roberts Alexis Rodriguez Bargavi Rohill Catherine Roth Sean Ryan Mokol Sachan Akanksha Sagar Vibe of Sahai Polkit Sanadia Alexis Sanchez Matthew Sanchez Shurud Reddy Santa Parody Shubham Sauji Nikunj Sarda Dunanjay Sarsonia Swarada Sathe Chaitali Gajanan Sathe
Sahil Ravindra Sawant. Timothy Schlinger. John Schrage. Calpac Seal. Claire Seiler. Shays Terran Sekarin. Priyam Seliger. Arth Shah. Manav Shah. Ravan Shah. Sheshav Harshadbhai Shah. Parth Shah. Kenal Shah. Manan Shah. Rohan Sanjay Shahane. Fayaz Sheikh. I would like to thank my friends and family, especially my mom and dad. This would not have been possible without the constant support. This one is for you. Ting Shan. Bharat Shankar. Rajat Sharma. Nidhi Sharma. Ayush Sharma. Neha Sharma. Akilesh Shastri. Wei Han Shen. Yu Chi Shen. Pradeep Babu Shetty. Nathan Shin. Sameya Shomaji. Siddhanta Shroff. Hamza Silmi. Mirela Silva. Yudiksha Singh. Ramandeep Singh. Amanjat Singh. Rajandeep Singh. Vivek Singh. Jasmine Rajendra Singh. Thank you so much, Mom, Dad, and all my friends for providing me all the support and strength to pursue this path. Go Gators! Ipshita Singh. Akriti Singh. Rachel Singleton. Adam Sittler. Alexander Smith.
James Snyder. Shonak Sampara. Jiwei Song. Hongi Song. Jingxing Song. Haoqing Song. Bovin Sony. Nadish Sud. Jason Seven. Barg of Ram Shrina. Sai Bhaskar Sripada. Victoria Steinecker. Ariel Stevens. Thanks everyone for supporting me, especially my family and my husband and my cat. <laughs> Marie Estas Kova. Kimberly Stubbs. Ice Warrior Suburaj. Xin Yang Sun. Xu Fa Soon. Wei Bin Sun. Zhao Jie Sun. Jia Chi Sun. Xiang Yu Sun. Desi Ken Sundararajan. Andre Sura. Kirthi Suresh. Santosh Suresh. Sankita Sanjay Survey. Brendan Sutton. Jiwen Tan. Yunjia Tang. Nickel Tank. Shi Tao. Power and Tao. Yefan Tao. Arun Kumar Tata. Brendan Taylor. Caitlin Taylor. Brandon Tayan. Swaroop Thava. Arun Kishan Thiragnana Sambandam. Srinivas Tamala. Privy Thomas. Prajan Taikayala. Jameson Toxteen.
up? Thank you for checking in on my graduation. I just want to give a shout out to all the friends, family, and faculty who have supported and encouraged me over these past few years. It's meant a lot, so thank you all. Ashley Ray Lundra Tramble. Chuang Tran. Sean Tromans. Sung Kut Sai. Chad Tucker. Nikolesh Reddy Tamala. Sathik Subramanya Udupa Sujay Uskayankar Yugendar Reddy Vadiala Ahalaf Vanam Vijay Maitan Venkatachalam Jai Gopal Ashwat Venkataraman Austin Vera Saurabh Varma Suchit Varma Shreya Varma Latia Vialba Mano Jasas Vivutukaro Rahul Wahi Yun Hawan Zichian Wan Rohan Haymont Wanar Yong Wang Chi Chu Wang Wei Qian Wang Musi Wang Winting Wong Jiai Wong Ji Peng Wong Xin Shuang Wong Jing Fan Wong Kai Dong Wang Han Chiu Wang Jean Gwen Wang Zi Sun Wang Jia Wang Ihuei Wang Etian Wang Yua Wang Borui Wang Yike Wang Yunong Wang Yubo Wang 
Tong Yen Wong. Win Xuan Wang. Wen Wang. Marley Wasserman. Alexander Weber. Eason Wei. Yao Wei Jacob Weissman Jiren Wan Marlon Wajkun Brandon Wiley All my family and friends that supported me throughout this entire journey, and congratulate all my classmates for finishing our OEM degrees. Go Gators! Kyle Wilson Ryan Winslow Chiran Widenachi Charles Wolf James Wood Nikki Wardens Tian Chi Wu Xin Ron Wu Ao Hien Wu Jiachi Wu Shauna Wyatt How she Thanks to my family and my friends Everything is the best agreement I will work harder and reach the peak of my life You see a Jingyi Xia Tianzhuo Xia Jun Han Xiang I'm so happy today and thanks for my parents for sending me to UF and thanks for all the professors who gave me class today. Lucio Junicia Li Hong Sia Jiahuai Su Pei Jia Su Ninja Su Jing Su Hui Yuan Shui Xu Yu Yang Ya Kin Yang Yi Bing Yang Chen Yang
Gina Young. Chain Ging Young. Chin Yu Young. Kai Tai Young. Christina Yannette. Siddharth Yeller Sathiish. Juan Hangin. Peng Fein. Jonathan Illander. Jeremy Youngquist. Fang Zhou Yu. Tong Ching Yu. Jiao Luan Yu. Kei Tai Yu. Jean Hyuk Yu. Feeling you. You are hang you in. How to and you. Taylor Yuska. Sergio Zani. Guan Lin Zeng. Yi Fun Zeng. Congratulations on my accomplishment with master program and wish me had a good luck in the future. Peng Yu Zhang. Gang Jie Zhang. Yong Xu Zhang. Jian Zhang. Chi Wei Zhang. Hu Yuan Zhang. Yi Fan Zhang. Hao Yang Zhang. Jian Zhao. Ji Yang Zhao. Wen Wei Zhao. Zi Yu Zhao. Han Qing Zhao. Wandi Zhao. Xin Hong Zhao. Zi Han Zheng. Tian Yu Zheng. Hao Yang Zheng. Han Song Zhou. Yang Ru Zhou. Zi Wei Zhou. Xiang Zhou.
I couldn't have done this without the incredible love and support of my wife, mom, and daughter. Thanks, my love, and go Gators! Pengzhou. Jia Xu Zhu. Hong Wen Zhu. Ming Xin Zhu. Hai Zhu. Fang Rongzhou. Nicholas Abuid. Brendan Allen. Ali Al Qureshi. Hi. Thank you very much for everyone who supported me during my PhD program at University of Florida. It's done. Go Gators, Ali al -Qurafi. Dylan Anstein. Rahili Baharlo. Deanna Busalis. Renuka Boratho. Kwan Sun Cho. Winston Thomas Chu. Thank you to my advisor, my committee members, all the members of the Laboratory for Rehabilitation Neuroscience, all the wonderful friends I've made at UF, my family, and my fiance, Deanna. Conrad Cole. Atul Prasad Deb Nath. Mikeela DeLuca. Elliot Deer. Moses DeVacker. Shangrid Hanva Eswara Basis. Ahmed Fahmi. Jen Yu Fu. Abdul Latif Gari. Joshua Garno. Li Heng Guan. Mehran Hamayanfar. Brian James. Venkata Surya Chaitanya Kolaru. Tabhagya Kumar. Yan Jun Li. Chen Li. Song Chi Li. Ying Ma. Naja Mack. Drove Mahajan. Vikram Mihar. Shashank Menon. Alexander Miller. Majid Mirzanije. Dikita Moon Rembert.
To God be the glory. Thank you to my other home, Curtis, to my family, friends, and my advisor for their support. Go Gators! Robert Moy. Kingashuk Mukherjee. Jamie Murbach. Naklon Nguyen. Seth Nidham. Caitlin Alchak. Kendall Parker. Karen Pounds. Kimberly Prince. Eugene. Narain Srivats Raman. Sagrika Rath. Nicole Roby. Baruch Rodi. Ali Sadegian. Nicholas Schwartz. Anirud Shekawat. Lee Nguyen Shur. Forrest Shriver. Matthew Sillick. Cardic Sondi. Chad Spreadberry. Prabal Tuwari. Eduardo Torres Villavicencio. Arsenios Nicolaus Tsokas. Emily Turner. Valerie Valerio Holguin. Vishal Vignesh. Jason Vosatka. Ding Kong Wong. Howard Wong. Huan Yu Wong. Yi Wei. Joseph Wiggins. Hun Tao Yao. Sundara Yerasuri. Ting Ting Zeng. Woi Jung. Yu Chen Zhou. Sheng Zhou. Congratulations, Gator Engineering Class of 2021. Please join us for the singing of our alma mater.